JoJo's Bizarre Episode 10. Hi. You Somebody said hi. JoJo's Bizarre Adventures Episode 10. How you feel about that episode? You got to meet him. Well, first of all, Joseph is a bitch. <laughs> what? <laughs> Where did that even come from? Well, first of all, first off, we can't say it on YouTube. This is YouTube again. Joseph sucks. <laughs> You want Joseph? Yo, for that freaking point thing, you was like, <laughs> yo, man, look, dog, I'm going to just sit here. You can rob everybody in here, but I'm going to just sit here and listen, I mean, look at my comics. Listen, dog. man, he, he was 13 and kind of edgy. Kind of? <laughs> <laughs> so, Joseph, definitely my favorite character out of the entire series. Yeah, he's right. There's no, there's no question about it. Well, he does have more uh, more edge to him. Way more. Yeah. At the same time, like he like like he said, he's like he may be Jonathan's grandson, but he's definitely not Jonathan. Jonathan by far. Man got a temper on him too. So how do you feel about the whole speed wagon thing? Him dying? Yeah. Well, I mean, it, it sucks that it happened because I mean it, he wasn't that old to begin with, so it ain't like he would have died like in a couple of days of old age. Yeah, I think he may have been like what 70, 75, yeah, something like 75. that. About, about seventy five. Because I always assumed during the first series, because it was 50 years ago, that it was... Like 25. He was like 24, 25, yeah. somewhere around. He might have even been 27, damn near. So it made it worse that he died right then and there. And plus by somebody that that he was cool with. Yeah, it's straight so turning on him. I don't think any of them saw that coming. Well, we obviously know all of them didn't see that coming. Considering how fast they all died. Speedwagon was the only one that actually saw it coming even slightly. So predictions. Uh, what's that dude's name? Straso? Straso. Strazo? Oh, uh, he got he got hit with the Mac. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what about the Tommies? <laughs> he first and foremost, most likely as we see from freaking Dio, he ain't gonna be he ain't dying over no bullets. Oh uh, yeah, of course. That's not even a spoiler. That's just obvious because he used the mask. But I gotta say that when I first watched it. Uh, it was after this episode that I had told you. I, no, I think I was a little bit further. Yeah. But I had watched all those episodes within one day, like four yeah, or five from one, basically. But I was like, bruh, I liked Joseph when they first introduced him a lot. But when he put out the, the, the Tommy gun, I was like, no, stop, stop. I had to that episode so real fast. Him. Exactly. Because like you said, it was like, how did he just pull that out of his back pocket, damn man? <laughs> So predictions for the entire season. See if you can get this one right. Entire season? Entire season. Where do you think it's going? They've given you something to work with. Oh, now it's gonna, instead of freaking Dio and Jonathan, now it's freaking Joseph and Strazo. And, uh, most likely Strazo is going like, he ain't going, he ain't going to kill the freaking grandmother. I feel as though she's going to give more insight to the past of, like, Jonathan and all of them and stuff. Like, help him more on, like... What well, she wasn't really the history, that the history much. Of that much. Yeah, because she she could only know as much as she could. But it's at like, the same time, it's like, well, Speedwagon probably is told it filled in because he was there the entire time. Yeah, I'm like, I'm amazed you made it to 75 with as much stuff as you were around with no powers. You're pretty crazy, actually. But we're actually going to leave that off there. The rest of the episodes probably going to go at a single rate because this is way too much recording. It's like 3 a.m. right now. For us to be recording, to be exact. double drops for you guys, but those episodes were important to put together, so we kept putting them together. And we've got more anime on the channel, from Naruto to Haikyuu, Fullmetal Alchemist, and more. So, uh, we upload we upload on a pretty consistent schedule and everything. The only thing that adjusts itself sometimes is the time of day, because of the editing process and different things. So, we'll get more consistent with that as time goes on, but JoJo's Bazaar usually comes out either Sunday or Monday currently. So, turn on that bell notification so you can know. And uh, see you guys later.